Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. Uh, the topic is uh, white blood cell count and uh, this video is about uh, the understanding or uh, the interpretation of the uh, white blood cell count results you know. And before starting I would like to request you to like, subscribe and share this video. You know, the abnormal uh, test results are classified by numbers that are higher or uh, lower than the normal range of your age you know and uh, low or the high uh, white blood cell count can point uh, to a blood disorder or the other medical conditions you know and to identify the exact cause of the high or the low uh, white blood cell count uh, your doctor will take several factors into consideration uh, such as your list of current medications, uh, the symptoms, and the medical history. Now, leukopenia is the medical term which is used to describe the uh, uh, low uh, white blood cell count, you know. And a low number can be uh, triggered by uh, HIV, uh, autoimmune disorders, uh, bone marrow disorders or damage, you know, uh, severe infections, uh, lymphomas, uh, liver and spleen uh, diseases, lupus or radiotherapy, and uh, medications such as antibiotics, etc. You know, and uh, leukocytosis is a term which is used to describe the high uh, white blood cell count than the normal range, you know, and uh, it can be triggered by smoking. Uh, infections like uh, uh, chest infections like or lung infections like tuberculosis you know and the tumors in the bone marrow uh, leukemia and the inflammation uh, uh, such as arthritis or the bowel disease you know stress exercise and uh, uh, pregnancy uh, tissue damage allergies asthma and uh, some medications such as corticosteroids you know so they can cause the uh, to uh, uh, increase the number of white blood cell count you know. and uh, after diagnosing the cause of the high or the low or wbc count and uh, recommending a treatment plan uh, your doctor will periodically recheck the white blood cells you know and uh, if your white blood cell count remains high or low, this can indicate that your condition has worsened, you know. And your doctor may adjust your treatment or the dose of the treatment according to the requirement, you know. And if your white blood cell count shows a normal range, this usually indicates that the treatment is working well, you know. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you need more information about any disease, any medical condition, you can visit our website www.diseaseandtreatment.com and please do not forget to subscribe to this channel for more informative videos every day. The next videos will be about the questions and answers. Uh, uh, so I have uh, a few patients to have the multiple questions, you know. So uh, I will answer those questions um, separately. So keep watching.